Let's start with a few ways of creating integrals. Note that these methods will work whether you're in a 1D processor window or in a data slate. Let's start with manually drawing an integral. To do this, we'll select the Create Integral cursor from the cursor bar and left click, hold the mouse button, and drag in order to define an integral region. Wherever you, or the integral will be actually defined whenever you let go of the mouse button. So pay attention to the position of the cursor. One could go through and make as many integral regions as they would like in this method. Or if you have a lot of peaks and would like to mass integrate the entire spectrum, click the auto integrate button. A series of integrals will be drawn due to a few factors that we'll cover in a later tutorial. If you'd like, you could always go through and resize integrals if they've been created in a way you don't like. For example, let's take the integral of this triplet here, which is probably a bit wider than what we would or how we would integrate it if we wanted to do it by hand. You can reset the bounds by left click, dragging, or hold, left clicking, holding, and dragging on these little boxes here. We'll do the same thing with this integral as well. Notice in this case that the system happened to draw one big integral for these two peaks rather than two separate ones. If that's the case, you can left click and hold on the top left corner of the integral box here. Notice that the cursor changes to a set of scissors. When you click and hold and then release, the integral will be cut at that point into two separate integrals. Next, let's deal with normalization. If you want to normalize a peak to a certain value, select it by left clicking on it and change the normal value here. In this case, I know it's a methyl group, so I'll normalize it to a value of three. Alternatively, one could normalize multiple peaks to a certain value. Say this quartet or this methylene and this triplet. Multiple integrals hold the control and shift key and left click on one or more integrals that you'd like to multi-select. Then you could change the normalization factor or normalization value in order to sum those integrals together to that value. Let's say you wanted to get rid of an integral instead. Again, one can select the integral and simply hit the delete key on their keyboard. Or if you'd like to get rid of all integrals, press the A key on your keyboard to select them all and hit delete that way. Note that once integrals are defined and you save your data, those integrals will persist in future, for future use. Have comments, questions, or requests for additional videos? Please visit our forums on the NMR support .jeol.com website or feel free to leave a comment on this video. Thanks for watching.